guys welcome back to the channel my name is Thea I'm a public health inspector by profession I'm also a makeup artist if you have not yet subscribed to the channel I'm just gonna please ask you to just hit that red button below I'm just asking you to also head over to my Instagram page it's Queen Thea underscore seven and you can also feel free to DM me if there if you have any questions on what I will be talking about today now i'm back with another public health video all right so let's get straight into it it's not gonna be a long video so feel free to stay and watch until the end it's gonna be very interesting and if you have any questions you can also leave them in the comment section below all right so don't forget to like the video as well all right now the question that i've received i've received a bunch of questions but i will be taking care of each question in separate videos all right so as not to make the video too long basically today i will be talking about um one of the questions that i receive which is what are some of the pros of being a health inspector or what are some of the things that i like um being a health inspector all right so one of the question is also the cons so it's basically the pros and the cons of being a health inspector but what i will be talking about today it is the pros of being a health inspector or some of the things that i like all right so just a quick disclaimer out there i the things that i am gonna be talking about they are basically um from my experience right so other health inspectors may have different experience based on their type of personality um who they are also the parish that they are working in and various other factors may affect their experience all right so i'm just gonna put that out there that the things that i will be talking about are basically about me being a health inspector all right so maybe some of the pros or some of the things that I like you may not like just putting that out there all right now some of the pros for being a health inspector are I'm gonna talk about basically six of them one of the things that I love is the flexibility of the job right so you're not stuck in any office every day doing the same thing over and over right so you're not stuck in the office you're able to change up stuff your duties and all of that based on the parish as i said right so you are not doing one thing every day right so example you're not just doing food and dust clinic every single day so maybe maybe on monday the food and dust clinic tuesday you're on the road doing food safety wednesday you are somewhere else right so you are not stuck the doing thing that i like about being a health inspector is you're able to socialize right so you may see me looking down is because i jack down my stuff because i'm not gonna remember everything right i'm getting older <laughs> So you're able to socialize with people on a daily basis so if you're a person that like to socialize you love to talk to people right this is for you I love to talk to people I love going out there just reasoning with people right that's not a problem for me but if you are not a people person it's gonna be difficult for you to break out of your shell but you can learn you can adjust um, so even if you are not that type of people person you are still able to adjust right but that's me i love talking to people so you must have good interpersonal relationship with persons you must be able to communicate well write well and so forth and in ways that persons can understand. always be able to be on the go right so this is another thing that i love you're always on the go always trying to be somewhere get somewhere and all of that right so you are very mobile so at some point in time you may be at this location the next five minutes you're at another location right so i love that about my job as well right so i'm not in the same location all the time so this minute five minutes i'm here next five minutes i'm there so it is very you know you're on the go at all times the next thing i like about as i said disclaimer is different in every parish you set your own itinerary right so for persons just coming in itinerary is like you basically set your own roster for the month and you 
put where you're gonna go etc and whatever you're gonna be doing for the month i remember it can change and so forth you're just proposing something so it's even still subject to change as well so that's another thing that i like so i can kind of plan ahead you know it kind of helps me to plan ahead a time like you know what i'm probably supposed to be doing that day and so forth and as i said things can change you know so you know it's all up to you that's another thing that i like um the fifth thing that i like is you are a uniform group right so you're easily identified by the public another thing it's the same uniform that you're wearing from monday to friday so you just basically you're in your uniform you don't have to be always mix and matching clothes or oh i'm gonna wear this outfit today that outfit today you just know that it's a uniform you're going to wear so i kind of like that order thing for me right i kind of like that order to say all right i'm in this uniform today i'm working all right you understand what i'm saying so i like the uniform thing so you just keep and care you make your uniform when you need to make them and another thing that you get you get um an allowance as well for that so you get a tailoring allowance where you get this every year right so this can be used towards making your clothes and you also get your uniform material which is a benefit to me because if i would have to go and purchase this again it would be costly on me as well to go purchase the uniform plus get it, get it made but we get the material and then we just get them made i would pay the dressmaker or the tailor or whoever to build these uniform for us so that is something that i Another like thing that i like is that i get my tools of trade right so i don't have to purchase these again on my own so every tool that you need to work with you get them right so if you need um books you get your book your field book you get your diary you get whatever it is that you need to work with your comparator whatever it is whatever tools of trade that that we use you are entitled to receive them as well all right so those are six pros six things that i like about being a health inspector and those are some of the things that I can remember so if you're a health inspector you can leave in the comment what are some of the things that you like that I didn't cover right and if you're new to this field and you want more information feel free to leave a comment feel free if you're shy to, to DM me right so you can do that as well all right so I hope that you like this video I hope that it benefits you in some way um, as I said, feel free to contact me whichever way you are comfortable. I know some of you are shy. If anything comes to mind, you can send me a message and I will create the video. As I said, engage in the comments section as well because it does help these videos to reach a wider audience and I would greatly appreciate it so I don't feel like I'm talking to a ghost. Alright, thank you so much guys for watching this video and see you guys in the next one so remember stay tuned for the cons what are some of the things i don't like i'll be addressing those in the next video so peace out bye guys